Today's uh, Dependent Filmmakers Coalition episode, I uh, just wanted to say a little bit about what's been going on with me. I've, I've been doing a lot of writing lately so I ha and some, some editing on, um, on various projects, but the, the one thing I would like you guys to share is that there's a couple of websites for writers out there that one that I particularly use is WordPress and it's a good place for, for writers, for Christian writers or as well as who, any artist out there who wants to just put their writing talents online and, and see what other feedback from other people uh, has out there and sometimes it's always a good thing to get a different different people's opinions on which what your work is of course as Christians we want to make sure that that we get uh, feedback from other Christians so like I said before um, one of the best places for me is to go to GodTube and I'll get a lot of a lot of brothers and sisters write back to me about my my videos and some of the uh, skits that our church does um, so the first one I would say was GodTube check that out the second one is going to be um, WordPress for writing and another one that I've recently found I, I put some stuff on Wattpad W-A-T-T-P-A-D um, there's I haven't seen too much of a Christian community out there but just check it out and see what you guys think as far as um, any more uh, opinions or anything uh, as far as equipment goes for for uh, Christian filmmakers that are on a on a budget basically what I would suggest that what I found recently was there's a lot more people who are doing making movies with uh, DSLRs digital uh, S single lens reflex I believe uh, cameras and so if you um, if you're were the person that said oh, yeah, I can't make a movie it costs millions of dollars it costs thousands of dollars for a camera at the high end a lot of people are using the Canon um, Mark series, Mark, I think it's Mark, uh, Mark five, Mark my or Mark five two D cameras, and that's the high end as far as then it goes. That's two thousand. Then the other ones I've seen people use are Canon um, two TIs, two uh, two three eyes, Rebel two three eyes type cameras. Now both of them, the I believe the older ones, they don't have microphone inputs. And what you want to do is have a separate recording device when you use uh, those type of SLRs. Of course, other types of cameras that I've that I've used is the Sony Webby. I wouldn't recommend it if you if you're in a situation where you can't convert it right away, or when you do convert it to from MP4 to another type of file size. What happens is that you um, can lose quality. If it's if it's not transferred over right, uh, other things, uh, other type of cameras out there that I've seen but I haven't used too much are um, regular digital cameras like the like the PowerShot. I've seen some good stuff with that. Um, the only real good uh, advice I would give as far as cameras go, you're gonna have to do your research. What can you afford to use? If you can go with the most expensive video camera out there with the three chips, HD, whatever, use the best quality camera for your project. And remember, it's about the message. It's about this. About this. If we're not, you can have the best camera in the world and you don't, you really don't have a message to go along with it. You don't have anything, anything of the gospel the good news to give an audience what did the apostle paul say it's it's nothing it's as this is as if it was dumb everything he did in the world was dumb compared to to what um he did for god for the kingdom of god and um finally there's uh um, if you want to check out any of my writing i have probably about three or four pages i put on um, a couple places the first one's going to be uh, they're basically the same pages, but the first one is on WordPress, and the link's going to be at the bottom here, right there. Okay, and the second place is going to be at Wattpad, and uh, the link's going to be over there. All right, this is all digital, but we had to add that effect later. 
but you can look at a word for Kasam for Christ uh, dot WordPress dot com, and the other one's gonna be at Wattpad. But what, what I'll do is I'll send you guys the links. It's gonna be posted up there. So anyway, God bless you guys. Remember, whenever you do a project, pray about it. I recently saw a movie, a very good Christian movie, and it was called Courageous. What? One of the things that the directors and producers have said in their interviews when I've read up on it was that they waited a whole year and prayed about it for a whole year before they even set um, pen to paper, before they set any kind of cameras or actors or any, anything to do with the movie. They actually prayed for a whole year before they actually, actually made it. So my suggestion to you, if you want to do something anointed, Ask for God's anointing, and don't do it on your own understanding. That's been my, that's been my uh, philosophy, and it's because it's all about Him, and uh, and nothing else needs to be said. You guys have a blessed day. God bless you guys.